welcome back to another day on the channel you guys today we're going to be talking about is how to prevent your locks from tracking excessive lint as well as how to remove lint from your locks all right so let's go ahead and get right into it all right so the first thing that you guys need to know when it comes to lint as it pertains to your locks is that a lot of the lint that you're going to see in your locks is going to be caused by either cotton material fuzzy material such as sweaters or your pillowcase or sheets so you guys want to make sure that you guys are being mindful of your sleeping routine your sleeping habits uh, make sure that you guys are avoiding cotton pillowcases as much as possible uh, recommended that you guys are using satin pillowcases satin sheets um, also make sure that you guys are wrapping your hair up at night um, using a satin bonnet you want to make sure that you're doing that some because not only is that going to you know minimize the amount of length that you're going to be attracting it's also going to help maintain your locks and keep your locks healthy and keeping your locks neat and fresh. Um, when it comes to lint in your locks, you want to make sure that you are being mindful of the lint in your locks and treating this as soon as possible. Um, you can either do it in two ways. Um, you can either do spot treatment or you can try to do a whole lock treatment. With the spot treatment, you guys want to make sure that you're using a tweezer as such, a little tweezer, just picking in your locks and just being very gentle and just picking out the lint in your locks. Also, for whole lock treatments, you can either go two different routes you can either get a soft baby brush or you can just do a full spot on spot treatment dye um, as it relates to the baby brush you want to make sure that you're being soft and gentle you don't want to use anything harder you don't want to use a medium brush you don't want to use a hard brush you want to stick to a baby brush simply because with the baby brush um, it's going to be very very gentle on your locks anything harder gonna, is going to cause weak spots in your locks it's going to cause damage and it might just cause a little bit of breakage which is something that you don't want um, also, you want to make sure that before you go on with brushing your locks, you want to make sure that your locks are very, very, very mature. I recommend, you know, just sticking with the spot treatment with the tweezers simply because it's very, very easy to do. Um, it's not going to cause any damage to your locks and it's just very, very safe and just very simple. Anyone can do it. Um, lastly, what you guys can do um, as a last resort, you guys can also do a spot treatment dye on your locks just to try to, you know, dye the lint in your locks just that way it blends in. Because sometimes, if you are not catching that lint in your locks early enough, it's going to lock into your lock. And it's going to be kind of nearly impossible to get that lint out of your locks uh, without, you know, you know, causing damages and causing weak spots to your locks. Alright, and then also, you guys want to make sure that you guys are not, do not try cutting the lint out of your locks. Because it may prevent your lock from running off. You want to make sure, especially if you see any lint at the ends of your locks, just don't cut it. Um, it's because, like I said, it's going to prevent your locks from rounding off, which is something that you don't want because that's just going to make your locks just take even longer to mature, and it's just going to be something that you regret in the long term. So yeah, so just guys, just make sure that you're checking your hair regularly, regularly. As a, so, all right. So it says, all right. So like I said, just make sure that you guys are checking your hair regularly um, and monitoring your locks. Make sure that your locks are not tracking too much lint, and if there is. You guys have the three different ways to treat it. You guys need to use a tweezer for spots treatment. You guys need to dye it, um, the, the whole lock, you know, to help the lock blend in with the lint. Or you guys can use a soft baby bristle um, just to try to, you know, brush all that lint out the lock. Um, thank you guys for tuning into this video. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. And until next time.